Remember those lights in the sky last weekend noticed by so many at Cape Coral's Coconut Festival? Well, it turns out folks in Florida weren't the only ones seeing the strange sight that most believe were UFOs. As Foreign Recorder's Kelly Stegeman is finding, calls came in from far and wide. And you can see the light go. This is a cell phone video another Cape Coral family is now showing us from that now famous Saturday night in the skies over southwest Florida. It was bright red and we saw about 15 of them going straight through the sky. I, I mean, I don't know what it was. And the director of the National UFO Reporting Center in Washington State tells me by Skype, Cape Coral is not alone. The reports that came to the National UFO Reporting Center on Saturday night, the 10th of November, were remarkable. They were stunning to me. I really don't think I fully understand the phenomenon that I'm dealing with. He's compiled reports from across the United States, all from the same night. Clusters of red, orange, or yellow, or amber fireballs. The Rebstock family was walking home from the Coconut Festival on this very same Cape Coral Road when they looked up to the sky and immediately knew they had to capture this on camera. Where do you think the fireball came from? I don't know, maybe from someone that was trying to kill a bad guy. I shared the UFO Center's reports with them, and they say those descriptions in other places matched exactly what they saw. Do you guys have chills right about now? Yeah, I, do. I do. Now, are you now believers? It's going to have to get a little more solid than that for me to believe. I don't know. <laughs> I think that, you know, it's a possibility. Like I said, I, I can't rule it out 100%, yeah. especially, you know, after, you know, the information that's been presented to me. It, it kind of seems like that's probably what it is. If it is real, it is, in my opinion, probably the scientific question of greatest importance before the American people. Namely, are we alone or are we not? Kelly Stegeman, Fox 4, in your corner. Foreign Corner learned just before the newscast there are investigators with the Florida chapter of MUFON investigating these lights right now in Lee County. We'll, of course, let you know what they find. The UFO Center director says if you see something, write it down immediately in detail and then call his hotline. The number we've listed there is 722 3000. Meanwhile, many of you are calling the Fox 4 hotline with your own theories on what was out there in the sky. I've seen the three lights, that's a mothership, and if you look real close, there's a dark triangle or shadow between the three lights, and that's where little orbs come from, and then they hover. They were actually those Chinese lanterns. You light up, and it's a, and it's like a balloon, and it floats up, and then when they go out, they fall to the ground. That's exactly what they were. I believe it was the squadron of World War II Avenger aircraft. They've never been found. I love it. All right, we still want to hear what you think. Was it a UFO or something else? Call us at 206-FOX4, or you can send us an email at fox4now.com.